Hey, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sandra Shongwe. And listen, I know, I know, I've been away for quite some time now. But look, I'm back feeling energized and ready to take you along my journeys. Yes, yeah, so I left my place in Joburg and now I'm making my way to Eswatini, which is about three and a half hours plus minus. Now, we made a stop at Aozu Petrol Port for a quick, you know, bathroom stop and then get some refreshment. And off we go. Okay, we are now driving through Carolina. This is a very small town, you guys. Now, this town is situated in the Mbumalanga region. It is known for its coal mining activities in the area, and it also is a trade route between Bumalanga and Eswatini. Now, I always get excited whenever we drive past Carolina because I'm quickly reminded that I'm about, you know, an hour away from the Oshuk border. And the scenery is also pleasant to look at. By the way, have you subscribed? Have you liked the video? What are you waiting for? Subscribe now so you don't miss a notification whenever I post. By the way, it's also free if I have to remind you. <laughs> so go ahead and do subscribe to, you know, to support your girl.
yo finally so we got to the osho border and at this point our driver was like look guys because it's a bit of a queue why don't you guys cross over into the Nguenyo border and then i'll find you that side so we're like okay fine why not let's walk get our passport stamped and then head over that side at this point i was just excited to have arrived back home safely and in time because child these days the roads are not safe at all but we thank god all is well yeah so welcome to the Nguenya border post it is just beautiful it's cute and yeah there's a lot of activity going on around the area as well Okay, cool. I got my passport stamped. Dilly dilly dally. And then I thought, you know what? Let me just cross over so I can show you my people. You know, you know what, what the surrounding areas are like around the border gate. Now, I have to say, I almost got left behind by the transport there, but it's all good. Um, so, yeah, what you find is you'll find the mamas that sell the food, the local foods, they sell maize. They sell street food there and if you want a SIM card, which I strongly advise for my people that live outside of the country, they will sell you either an MTN SIM card or a Swazi mobile SIM card. So those are the only two mobile networks that we have in the country so far. And if you need transport, no need to worry, there's a Kumbi right there. Now we call them a Kumbi. Some call it a taxi in South Africa, others call it a matatu or a daladala, wherever you're from in East Africa or whatever. But yeah, so we have um, transportation leaving the border gate, heading to the main town of Mbabane, right? The capital city of Mbabane. Now, depending on where you are going in the country, if you need to move around, perhaps let's say to Manzini or elsewhere, you can easily transfer from, you know, the taxi rank in Babane, which is where the taxi will drop you off. So, yeah, it's all good at this point. We're leaving and I'm just so excited. Like, yay, finally, we are going to be home soon. It's too hot. I don't know why. It's just a mess, right? I'm just excited to be home just to refresh and take a nap from a very long day. Stick around and watch soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Subscribe, always subscribe. Like, thumbs up. Support your girl. Welcome to the city of Mabane, as you can see, it's a very beautiful city, <sighs> just got dropped off of my shuttle and now it is time for me to go and get some food. So there's a KFC over there, there is a Nando's and yeah that's just about it, those are the only drive throughs so far. And what you see, that big building right over there is the Hilton Inn, or the Hilton Garden Inn. Um, this is our biggest, I believe, hotel, yeah. So, yeah guys, let's go and get some food and then 
catch a ride to the house. See you in minutes. Okay guys, we are in Mbabane right now and when I tell you the heat, <laughs> the driver tells me that uh, currently the temperature is at 31 so it's scorching hot sweating to my knees but we're glad to be home again i hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog this far don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will definitely see you soon Welcome to my beautiful city, you guys. This is my hood. This is my kasi, mikasa, whatever you want to call it. But this is where I call home, right? And this is where we live for most of our time, apart from the village. So this is uh, one of two capitals, and it's located in the Hoho region. It was founded in 1902, and we have a very small population. We have just about 100,000 people. But I will say that Mbabane is a vibe, you know, there's a lot to enjoy, a lot of activities. You can go to the park if you want. You can go um, to some, you know, country clubs where there's poetry. You know, there's, there's so much to do if you want to go out, go out with your peoples. Whatever you want to do, hiking, whatever you want to do, it's all available to you. Just stick around, stick around and I'll take you around my people. Like I said do subscribe do like it's all free of charge support your girl let us grow road to 500 come on we can do those guys road to 500 right we're already at 300 let's let's just get to 500 and then from 500 let's get to a thousand come on let's do this i know we can do this right but thank you so much Thank you for sticking around even though i haven't posted like i said for a while but i do promise to be more consistent and yeah bring you the best of the best so do just that subscribe your girl and i'll see you soon right
what up you guys so it's the next day since i got back home and i was just too tired to post you guys it was a long trip it was hot like i said you know i was sweating to my knees so i couldn't do much there but yeah it's good to be back home and yeah I've been away and I know I've been away for like close to a year but I want to be more consistent with you know bringing something different to the channel incorporating both travel as well as cooking together so I hope that will excite you and I do appreciate your engagement I appreciate my day once you know always showing up in the comments please do continue this does boost my engagement, you know, when you throw a thumbs up, a like, a comment, or you share the videos, it really does help boost the channel. So please do continue with that. Now that I'm back home, um, I just want to try something different, like I said, um, show you around a bit. Um, but I must say, you guys, there isn't, I haven't seen one YouTuber here. So it's going to be interesting because I do know and I've noticed that when you do vlog here, people tend to give you a side eye like, what are you doing? You know, because yeah, it's, it's not something that's usual. But in the meantime, I'll bring you new and exciting content for now. Stick around to like, share and subscribe and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.